Welcome to this video. Are you interested in why your vehicle diagnosis displays B145C11? How is the error code interpreted by the vehicle? What does B145C11 mean, or how to correct this fault? Today we will find answers to these questions together. Let's do this. First, let's look at the history of diagnostic fault code composition according to the OBD2 protocol, which is unified for all automakers since 2000. We divide the electric system of automobile into the four basic units. Powertrain. Body. Chasis. Network. This distribution is defined in the first character code. If the second character is expressed as zero, it is a standardized error. In the case of numbers 1, 2, 3 it is a more prestigious expression of the car-specific error. The third character specifies a subset of errors. The distribution shown is valid only for the standardized DTC code. Only the last two characters define the specific fault of the group. The add-on to the error code serves to specify the status in more detail. For example, a short to the ground. Let's not forget that such a division is valid only if the other character code is expressed by the number zero. Our website airbagreset.sk produces useful videos for you. You do not have to go through the OBD2 protocol anymore to know how to troubleshoot any car breakdown. You will find all the diagnostic codes that can be diagnosed in a infinity, vehicles, also many other useful things. The following demonstration will help you look into the world of software for car control units. You unbelievably can move the video a bit further. The error code is split into two bytes consisting of 16 bits. One bit is the basic unit that each computer works with. The bit has two logical states. 0, low level. 1, high level. By combining the first two bits, the basic character of the error code is expressed. The next two beats again determine the second character. The last beat styles of the first byte define the third character of the code. The second byte is composed of a combination of eight bits. The first four bits determine the fourth character of the code. And the combination of the last four bits defines the fifth character. A single byte conceals 256 possible combinations. We now know in what way the diagnostic tool translates the received information into a more comprehensible format. The number itself does not make sense to us if we cannot assign information about it to what it actually expresses. So, what does the diagnostic trouble code B145C11 interpret specifically infinity car manufacturers? The basic definition is Control Module Configuration Incompatible General Failure Information And now this is a short description of this DTC code. Park Brake Module PBM receives information about vehicle configuration in question from Central Electronic Module SEM. The Diagnostic Trouble Code DTC is stored if the control module detects that the vehicle configuration from Central Electronic Module SEM is not the same as the one stored in the control module. Vehicle configuration from Central Electronic Module SEM is incorrect. The control module's test for the Diagnostic Trouble Code DTC starts in the event of ignition switch. Which position to note. The control module can only detect the fault once the test has been started and the diagnostic trouble code DTC is stored when the conditions are met. This diagnostic error occurs most often in these cases. Incorrect vehicle configuration The control module is not intended for this vehicle, for example, it is a second-hand control module with different software or hardware changed vehicle configuration that affects park brake module PBM read in a vehicle configuration done in connection with software download has not been performed correctly fault trace in transmitting control module circuit short to ground this subtype is used for failures, where the control module measures ground battery negative potential for greater than a specified time period or when some other value is expected. The Airbag Reset website aims to provide information in 52 languages. Thank you for your attention and stay tuned for the next video.